So the 2016 BET Awards aired recently and some mixed dude with colorful eyes who looks like a white man with a tan named Jesse Williams who happens to be an actor. So he's rich, he's famous, he's mixed, he has green or blue eyes. He did a speech that was quote pro-black and he dared to say that I don't know mixed men black men whatever are gonna start taking better care of black women some stupid shit and about black women being like the backbone of the black community some mess anyways this fool <laughs> had the black women going crazy because they like hearing what he was saying doesn't mean that he's committing any sort of actions but the simple fact that he said something was enough to make them just nut all over themselves you know he's talking all that pro-black big talk shit he didn't say anything about building an all-black economy and not giving white people your money he didn't say anything like that that would truly make a difference that would truly be revolutionary but he did run his mouth really well he didn't say anything about not race mixing keeping your genetics your sexuality your bodies and your finances to yourself but the simple fact that he talked all of this <laughs> i'm blackity black and i'm black y'all shit was enough for most black people especially black women who fell for the okie doke once again it's not about words people it's about actions that's my take on it do something instead of talking but anyways stacy dash apparently didn't agree with his corny little speech not because of the reasons that i say because he's full of shit and he's just speaking words and there's no actions attached to it so that was a waste of breath well actually it was effective in pissing off white people because they had it on all these different stations you know viacom I mean, they what they own VH1, MTV, BET. They they even play this shit up on Nickelodeon. They in Comedy Central, if I'm not mistaken, to so many different channels. Effective at pissing white people off. Just saw an article the other day about a Ku Klux Klan is supposed to rise up soon. That they're trying to recruit more and whatnot. Of course, they call themselves the Invisible Empire as well as other names nowadays. So when people say things like the Ku Klux Klan was a thing in the past, what they mean is they changed the name. So it's a true lie. Like the Ku Klux Klan, the name may not be popping the way it was, but they have other ways of being racist and disenfranchising people and, and whatnot. But anyways, that's neither here nor there. I have to make a separate video about that, explain things in more detail. It is what it is. I mean, if you don't know what's going on around you, I don't know what the hell to tell you. So what the hell does this have to do with Johnny Blaze? Well, she posted a picture of Stacey Dash on Instagram. And I'm going to read to the caption. She posted it and deleted it, but I caught it before she could delete it. Let me tell you something though. Stacy Dash spoke out against Jesse Williams in a speech at the BET Awards because she felt as if it was an attack on white people, or at least that's what she said. And of course, Stacy Dash is a an infamous Negro bedwench that's had plenty of white penises. I think she was married to three white dicks so far and things didn't work out. They just fucked her, busted nuts in her, probably kicked her in the back, pushing her into Planned Parenthood after Planned Parenthood to kill up baby after baby, you know, whatnot. But, I, I, okay, I'm just speculating here. I'm only speculating. I'm not saying that this is what she was doing. But you know what I mean? They they got what they wanted out of her. They fucked her and threw her to the side, fucked her and chucked her like most of you black women who swirl. She got fucked and chucked, as they should. They should never take a Negro bedwinch like her seriously. Stacey Dash is a joke. Just like all psycho swirlers, you're all a joke. Because swirling is for toilets. Hashtag flush them. So, Stacey Dash felt that he was attacking white people. Even though he's half white. His mama's white. <laughs> yeah, his mother is white. For anybody who doesn't know that. They showed her in the audience that day. But anyways... You know, Stacey Dash claimed that she thinks that he was attacking white people by talking some so-called pro-black stuff. Now, the funny thing about it is <laughs> Stacey Dash is a troll, but like most racist white people, she's a troll in real life. They're basically like gargoyles come to life, just evil monsters. And you know all racist white people and most conservatives which are pretty much racist white people are you know trolls in real life a lot of these liberals are too they're just really retarded i mean liberals are stupid just generally speaking but anyways stacy trash is looking for some attention and probably some coins somebody probably paid her to say what she said but johnny blaze was not too happy 
with what she heard Stacey Dash say. So here's what Johnny Blaze had to say about it. She said, I just want to know, have you always been this quote unquote clueless to society? Are you Trump's daughter? You think this is quote, the game we African-Americans play by making people look at us stupidly? Bitch better quote, get more money since she out here talking like a upper class dummy or BET equals bitch entertain these people with some real instead of selling out sorry that's been built up for months y'all now where is her instagram damn johnny you're gonna go hunt a bit down on instagram and snatch her bald aren't you i wonder if she ever found her instagram page and if she did i probably missed something really really good so if anybody saw anything let me know in the comment section hook me up Anyways, let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. For the record, even though Stacey Dash is a racist old white woman in the inside, from somewhere in the deep, deep south, living in a cabin type of racist. All jokes aside, though, just because she's a racist white woman in the inside, I still raw dog Stacey Dash. She can still get this mean three and a half inches all night and all day long. I'm just saying, I always wanted to <laughs> fuck her clueless. But anyways, let me know what you think about it below. <gasps> Meat Magazine. Stacey, you can get it. I will fuck the racism out of you. Because, hey, she's still black.